Welcome all of you to Football Breaking News. We are random football news today. The following are the details of today's content. Having said that, the interplayer is unproven in the Premier League, while Dalit has shown he can hold his ground in our league. Inter want to exchange £34 million target man United for Spurs failed Conti has vetoed the sale. Inter Milan are said to be interested in Tottenham's Emerson Royal, but must sell a player or two before making any deals in January. Emerson has exposed his defence several times since moving to England, but Antonio Conti still prefers him to the summer signing of Jed Spence, so what do I know? Surprisingly, 19-time Italian champions Inter Milan are interested in signing the Brazilian. This is according to Corriere dello Sport. Gone are the days when Serie A was known for its defensive mentality. Calcio Mercato, IT also reported Inter's interest, noting that they are in a race with another team known for their defensive prowess, Atletico Madrid. However, Conti has vetoed the sale of Royal. There is also an opinion that Conti is in love with Inter midfielder Alessandro Batoni, so he can put Emerson in the deal to recruit the Italian big man. Conti and Batoni clearly worked together during the time the head coach successfully led the Nerazzurri. The young defender was tipped to move to the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium last summer, but Conti was unable to reunite and instead signed Clement Langlet on loan. Corriere noted that Inter need to sell one of the two players before recruiting anyone but are expected to collect money from Denzel Dumfries rather than Batoni and replace him with the cheaper Emerson. The Italian giant signed the Brazilian fullback in 2021 before losing to Spurs in the race to sign the £21 million player. Dumfries joined Inter after a fantastic Euro 2020 campaign with the Netherlands, but is often tipped to leave the club. Although he is not really linked with a move to North London, sorry, Pascal Chimbanda, he would make a great signing for Spurs, in my humblest opinion. As well as bottlers from the capital, Dumfries has been closely linked with Chelsea and Manchester United. He is believed to be worth around 40 million euros, 34.4 million pounds, which is a pretty solid deal by all accounts. But is a Premier League opponent willing to risk losing the chance to face Emerson twice in one season? That's the big question here. Chelsea don't necessarily need a new right-back with Rhys James at the club, but the England international has been plagued by injuries for successive seasons and the Blues don't have a replacement ready in nearly the same capacity. Caesar as Pilicueta is a club legend, but today he is not a fullback. Ruben Loftus-Cheek played there, that says all you need to know, all will be respected. Todd Bowley paid more than £60 million to sign Mark Cucurella while Ben Chilwell was at Stamford Bridge. So £34.4 million for Dumfries, who can also play at fullback, is clear. Is the bargain of the century. The fact that he can function as a four-man defender is a bonus for United, who are also said to be interested in signing the Dutchman. Diogo Dalit became the number one choice for the Reds' right back as Aaron Wan-Bissaka picked debris from the Old Trafford bench off his back. While the Portuguese defender has impressed, especially this season, he can be upgraded and Dumfries will probably be an upgrade. Having said that, the Inter player is unproven in the Premier League, while Dalit has shown he can hold his ground in our league. The last detail also closed our hot football news today. Support us by liking the video and leaving a comment below the video. Click subscribe to the channel to receive notifications about the latest videos. Thank you all for watching.